this is the, I, I would say this is what I got from Moshe. He never said it like this, but what I bow to him for how this came to me that without awareness, you must repeat the past. Mm -hmm. Your brain will do what it already knows how to do. It's that's just the way it's like the law of gravity. It's if you have these grooves in your brain, those are the grooves that are going to work. So if we consider the ability to respond in new ways to our life as well, what is freedom if you don't have the ability to respond in new ways? So, so if, if we look at freedom in a very strict definition, new responses, that awareness is a prerequisite. Mm -hmm. And then I began to see that, well, to be aware, you have to be present in yourself. Because mm -hmm. if you're absent, if you're lost in your thoughts and feelings of the past and future, you're not open to the new possible information. So, so to be present was a precondition for awareness. Awareness is a precondition for freedom. And then I realized this fabulous discovery of Moshe and, and some others, but he really nailed it in my opinion, is that embodiment is a doorway to being present. That to be embodied, to be here, like if the people listening right now can, can take a moment and just feel their bottom on their seat, if they're sitting, mm. or to sense their right foot is touching something. Their left foot is touching something. And just, you can still hear my voice, but just doing that brings you into present moment. Mm -hmm. You can't feel your bottom and your feet and be thinking about dinner. You're, you're, you're here. And the here-ness of embodiment is what brings us to presence, awareness, and the possibility of responding in new ways to your partner when they give you that look <laughs> 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 or your child when they're having that or whatever it is you know i'm talking real stuff this is not airy fairy stuff this is our everyday life and do i have the possibility of responding differently when i hear that politician talking in that voice or am i wedded to my reactive pattern Right.